So apart from your standard GoPro stuff, you know, like this in car where you can't really fit or easily fit uh, a big professional camera, uh, we thought we'd try a few different instances and uh, with the addition of, you know, a little stabilised mount that we've sort of customised a little bit, we were able to take it skiing and indeed other places which uh, you wouldn't automatically think a GoPro would be good at. Hi, I'm Scott. And he's Dave. And we're representing Scout Radio here in Gran Valera, Andorra. So I, I hope that was interesting. Anyway, it was just an example, really, of the sort of shots you can now get with a GoPro that don't necessarily look like GoPro shots. You know, the sort of traditional image of a GoPro shot is that super wide, you know, distorted, slightly crummy picture. Whereas now, of course, with this GoPro 4, the picture is every bit as good as a small but much bigger video camera. So uh, I certainly will be experimenting with it now more in that way you know, more of a sort of B camera rather than a crash camera. Particularly now we've got that little, little stabilised mount. Suddenly the GoPro footage doesn't have to be wobbly and horrid anymore. I think it's actually going to be, you know, much more of a video camera than it was. it's always been seen to be. So uh, anyway, thanks for watching and see you next time.